What causes a car to jerk when slowing down? Living in Portland, Oregon, you get your fair share of stop-and-go traffic, especially when you're trying to get across town during rush hour. And let me tell you, nothing adds frustration to your daily commute like your car jerking every time you ease up on the gas or hit the brakes. So what's causing that annoying herky-jerky motion? First off, let's talk about automatic transmissions. They can be a bit finicky. Most of the time, your trusty auto is shifting smoothly through the gears without you even noticing. But if you're feeling a jerk when the car is downshifting as you slow down, it could point to an issue with the transmission. Maybe the fluid is dirtier than a downtown alley after Saturday night's shindigs, or the transmission is just starting to show its age. But hey, not all transmissions are automatic, right? If you've got a manual on your hands, then consider your clutch. If it's worn down or there's an issue with it, you might experience that sudden jerk. It's essentially the car's way of saying, hey, I'm not ready to shift down yet, give me a second. Then there's the chance it's not about shifting gears at all. Have a look at the fuel line or injectors. Nobody enjoys getting the hiccups, including your car. Dirty fuel injectors can mess with the smooth flow of fuel, causing a bit of a jerk as you're slowing down. Of course, we can't rule out the spark plugs or ignition coils. When they're not working properly, they can cause misfires, which feel like a brief hiccup or jerk in the car's acceleration, even as you're slowing down. The moral of the story? There's a laundry list of potential culprits behind your car's impromptu dance moves. Best to let a pro mechanic take a peek under the hood. Regular maintenance can help prevent some of these issues, so don't skip those service dates. After all, driving in Portland is much more pleasant when your car's running smoother than the Willamette River on a calm day.